So this video is a, a quick intro into how to enter a, a simple QL basic program, um, like a hello world program. And it also looks at um, fixing the froggy game that I mentioned in my previous video, so I can get that to run. So booting the next, pressing C to go into the Sinclair QL core as usual. So the toolkit prompt comes up. So now I can start typing in my basic program. So the usual stuff, 10 print high. And I'll just enter a, a few more lines. Uh, so if I run that, it prints out high in red. Uh, then I'll run, uh, then I'll enter a few more lines. So five clear screen, uh, 20, a four next loop. So I'll just cycle around 10 times, 30, I'll print out uh, F, the number of the loop, and then just add some ellipses on the end of that. Then 40, I'll do the next for the loop, close the loop. And then 50, I'll just print end to end the program. So I can list that and see it's all there. So CLS clear the screen. And then run runs the program. So you can see high, then the numbers, and then end at the end. So if I want to save that program, so it's high and then use underscore rather than dot in QL basic. So that should have saved the program. So if I dip, do a DIR of H, I can see my high underscore bass. So if I then clear the memory and do a list, see there's nothing there. And I can then load in the high underscore bass back in. Do another list. My program's there, so I can run it again and it just runs okay. And do a list and there's the program. Uh, if I want to edit a line, uh, I type edit and then the line number and then you You've got um, single line editing there, so you can change that particular line down on the bottom line. So I've changed it to Hello World. Um, so the listing's updated now. When I run that, it prints out Hello World. So they're new to clear the program and list, and there's nothing there. Um, so in my last video, I tried to run a, a basic game called Froggy, um, and that didn't run uh, because on line 120, it was complaining about um, a floppy drive uh, being in uh, the file name. So if I load that program in and then list it, I can see the program there. So the, the problem line is line 120 and line 125, both have FLP1 underscore. Um, but I don't actually need those, so if I do the line edit, I can edit that out. And then line 125, take that out as well. Uh, I'm not using the floppy drive. Those files are just there in the folder, so I don't need those. So that then if I save that as Froggy 4 Bass as a new version, and do a DIR, I can see that my Froggy Bass is there. So then if I try and run uh, froggy4 underscore bass and it's loading up. So I'm now able to run the program. I would need to use slow to slow it down as mentioned in the previous video. But that's how to get it running.